Wind 120 at 8 knots. Gusts 16 knots. Visibility 10. Sea links scattered at 1700 broken at 2500. Temperature 24 degrees Celsius. Dew point 22 degrees Celsius. Altimeter. Notice the airman. Left hand traffic. Hey guys, Jason here. Welcome aboard. Flying from Houston to Dallas today. I am loading the standard instrument departure, the SID, into the GPS. We'll be flying the GIFA 9 departure to GIFA intersection. So West Houston's down in the bottom center. See the little runway symbol. Normally we get direct bumco after departure to GIFA. And then that joins a star, standard terminal rival into Dallas. So I'm now selecting that in the Garmin. It's the Jaeger 4 arrival, so you can see Giffa that I've highlighted down in the bottom right. And then we go over Cedar Creek, and then Jaeger intersection, and then we get vectors for the approach. And that's all loaded in. So I've already got my clearance. I contacted clearance delivery on my cell phone. I've got another video that I'll link below where I talk about how I do that, so I don't have to do that after I start my engine, so I'm just setting my departure altitude now to 2,000. So we were given climb maintain 2,000, expect 10,010. So next we'll get our clearance for departure. Houston clearance, twin Cessna 69 or 744 on the ground at West Houston, number one for departure, runway 15. You did get your clearance uh, outbound? Uh, 744, that's affirmative. Clearance 744, roger, stand by. Twin Cessna 744, clearance. Twin Cessna 744, go ahead. Twin Cessna 744, you're released for departure now. When entering controlled airspace, fly heading 220, climb and maintain 2000, Houston altimeter 3010. Okay, Twin Cessna 69 or 744 is released, heading 220, climb maintain 2000, 3010, 744. Twin Cessna 744, your clearance is void in five minutes. If you haven't departed in five minutes, if I see some approach no later than 10 minutes with your intentions, contact departure. Once you clear the traffic pattern, frequency change is approved. Good morning. 744, good morning. Thank you. Okay, we have 2000, 220. Don't let me bust 2,000. West Houston traffic, twin Cessna 69er, 744 is departing runway 15, West Houston. Ready? Yep. Fuel flow is good, air speed's alive. Cross one there. Fuel flow is still good. Positive brake, gear up. Peace of departure, hello, Twin Cessna 69 or 744 off West Houston 220 out of 700 for 2000. Twin Cessna 69744 Houston departure event, climb maintain 10,000, get ready to climb. Climb maintain 10,000, 10,000, get ready to climb 744. Twin Cessna 744 and ident, please. And ident 744. Twin Cessna 744, your radar contact, a mile southwest of West Houston. Sub four four. One zero thousand set. Set. This is a seven four four turn right heading two nine zero. Right two ninety, sub four four. At eight fifty five heavy, descend to maintain three thousand. Set to maintain three thousand, eight fifty five heavy. At eight forty six, fly heading zero seven zero and set the localizer. 
Heading 070, intercept localized, United 846 Heavy. Hey, after takeoff. Flaps up, gear up, go light. 3253, Houston, departure, contact, maintain 4000. Engine instruments all on the green, fuel pumps off. After takeoff, checklist complete. At 846 Heavy, you're three miles from the, correction, four miles from Ilpo. And this is maintain 3000, establish on a local hazard, cleared ILS, turn right, eight right approach. 3000, tell established, cleared the ILS, eight right approach, United 846 Heavy. Number 744, fly heading 300. 300, 744. At 846 Heavy, maintain 170 knots or greater till Matan. 170 or greater to Matan, United 846 Heavy. United 855 Heavy, turn right heading 350. Right turn 350, United 855 Heavy. Cessna 744, turn right heading 360. Right to 360, 744. United 55 Heavy. United 63 Heavy, reduce speed to 210. Sky West 3253, turn right heading 270. United 855 Heavy, you're four miles from Milpo, maintain 3000 to establish on the local hazard, cleared ILS runway 8 right approach. 170 on the speed, United 55 Heavy. Number 744, flighting 010, departure on 132.25. 132.25 and 010 on the heading, 744. Houston departure, hello, Twin Cessna 69 or 744 out of 6,100 for 10, 10,000. Number 69744, Houston Departure, Houston Altimeters, 3011, proceed direct BUMCO. 3011, direct BUMCO, 744. Staff mode engaged. United 1253, Houston departure for the contact. Good morning, climb maintain 16,000. Climb maintain 16,000, 16, United uh, 1253. For United 1253, okay, if we come a little bit left, sir, for a few miles. United 1253 approved as a question, are, are you ADSB equipped? Thousand to go. Hey. Delta four zero three Houston departure out of contact. I maintain one six thousand. One six thousand Delta four zero three. Five hundred to go. Check. Direct Bump Co. What I do with this old autopilot is I actually kind of roll it, uh, roll the descent rate down, reduce the, uh, sorry, the, reduce the climb rate before I engage the uh, altitude hold. And there we go, one zero ten thousand level autopilot altitude engaged. Departure point south is 2478.3.2 for 4000, heading 020. And we'll reduce the power here to... Southwest 2478, Houston departure for the contact, climb maintain 16000, climb maintain 16000, and uh, heading 350, southwest 2478. Southwest 2478, area Increase light, the friction here. 12 o'clock, 6 miles, 3 miles in diameter. Yeah, we'll lean in, just all this initially do it on... 
Delta 403, proceed direct Willis. 11 and a half gallons an hour Rick per minute Willis, here. Delta 403. Then I'll lean it out. Number 700, Charlie, contact Houston Center, 134.8, have gone. I keep hearing him give center frequencies to other people. So I, what I've done here on the radio is I've put uh, that frequency in, anticipating that's likely the frequency we're going to be given. So I put it in standby here. I'm sorry about that, yes sir, Delta Yeah, you see the rain, rain is kind of in a, a rain Great band, band. Delta circular rain band, that's kind of what was a kind of pseudo-tropical depression trying to form yesterday that off the Gulf. Thank you. Today it's made landfall and it's just uh, giving a bit of rain. CGTs and EGTs are all pretty well balanced. Hey, Houston, United 2229, 14 3, climbing 1 6 000. Wide open throttle. 2229, Houston, gives us a manifold pressure of 21 inches. 60. RPM of 2300. 2229. And we we're uh, clipping along because of that uh, aforementioned low pressure. We're on the east side of it, so we've got a pretty good tailwind, about a 10 knot. Southwest 2478, contact, Fort Worth Center 12227. So our true airspeed. 32.27 today, so that's 2478. True airspeed is about 170 knots. That's looking back past at the direction to the west to where that uh, little weak low pressure is. Fort Worth Center, good morning, Twin Cessna 69er 744, level at 1010,000. Twin Cessna 69er 744, Fort Worth Center, good morning, Alcine out there, 3016. 3016, so 4-4. I'm just going to descend down, back down, since the altimeter temp has changed. Re engage the altitude hold. Okay, we're going to go ahead and do the approach briefing. We're still uh, in cruise right now, but the wind's out of the south, so anticipating it's going to be the ILS runway 18 approach. This chart's valid until 17th June 2021. The localizer frequency is 109.35, which we have in the radio here already. Approach course is 179. 7,000 foot long runway, airport elevation is 589. On the notes, uh, I don't see anything that applies to us. It's all about altimeter settings. We've already preloaded our frequencies in, uh, tower and uh, the weather, the ASOS. We're probably going to be vectored out to the east. The uh, Final approach fix altitude is 2,100 feet. And then we'll join the glide slope down to 776. This approach is climbed straight ahead to 1,500 feet. Then the climbing left turn to 2,400 feet to heading 360. And then we'll go to the missed approach fix. Now doing 197 knots. November 69 or 744, would you like to go direct Jaeger? 744, that would be great. Love to go direct Jaeger. November 744, clear direct Jaeger. Direct Jaeger, puts us to 744, thank you. Southwest 11, Fort Worth Center, good morning. Maybe a little bit of light shop in the decent, nothing worse. Southwest 
Southwest 2720. How's your eye been? Number 4-3, Victor Alpha 4 Center, good morning. Make it a little bit of intermittent leg shots to get closer to wind. 10 degrees right, vector for traffic, all blower for you in about a minute. Good morning. Okay, we were given uh, Cross Jaeger at 6,000, so we're going to program the VNAV, put 6,000 feet. I'll uh, put zero miles before Jaeger at 500 feet per minute, so we'll begin our descent in 11, well, 10 minutes. 50-something seconds, 11 minutes, let's call it. And let's look at the plate here. Uh, let's just double check on the uh, Jaeger 4. At Jaeger, we'll depart heading 315, unless told otherwise. American 1066, course in a red. So it's us to 6 9 or 7 4 4 vacating 1 0 thousand for 6 thousand. Number 600 7 4 4, Roger. That's a controversial so call. Some people say you don't need to do that. I always do that. Good. And he's giving people 135 2 for regional approach, so I put that standby. Chances are we're going to get that, and then we're going to reset our altitude. Bug 6,000. Okay. It's going to drop the manifold pressure about an inch. It's going to just keep us going too fast. I'm not going to touch the mixture. Visibility one zero miles. Ceiling 1,000, overcast. Temperature 2.2, two, dew point 1.9, altimeter 3.020. Expect ILS approach, runway 18. Romeo. Information Romeo at McKinney, 1,000 foot overcast, 10 miles visibility. Approach from Cessna 600 sub 44 to sending out 7,200 for 6,000. We have Romeo at McKinney. 69744, read on approach with ILS 18. Expect ILS 18, sub 44. Number 9 with Kamai, fighting 360. 360 on the heading. Southwest 3091, you. I'm just making sure I told you, RNAV with you on 3 left. Shreveport. 6625, ready. Climb and maintain uh, 5,000. 5,000, Mark 625. About 26, and I maintain 4,000. 500 4, to go. 26. Sending 9,000, Fox Rock. Vigit 694, regional approach, Victor ILS, storm 3 left. Great, Vigit uh, 694. Mark 625, heading 090. We've already briefed the approach. We're going to expect the ILS 18, which is already briefed. We'll go ahead and load that up. So we'll uh, look at the GPS here. Procedure, select approach. Uh, 26, two directed knock me, cross knock me at 4, clear RNF whiskey. Seven, we're going to get right, knock me, knock me at 4,000. So we'll load that. Uh, RNF whiskey, uh, 1, 3 left. That'll add that to the flight plan. Vigit 694, send to maintain 6,000. Send to maintain 6,000, six to 694. There it is, that little white line. Next flight up 3, 5. So we'll be, I'm sure we'll be getting back. Absolutely can, right, 625. Go and do the descent approach checklist. Armrest is stowed. Seat belts and harnesses are fastened. Mixtures are set. Fuel pumps are on low. Fuel selectors are on the tip tanks. Descent approach checklist complete. Zero nine zero more text. Go ahead and set uh, the local four thousand fighting a three four zero. Three four zero and four thousand sub four four. Southwest 3091, city right to knock me, cross it at 4,000, clear down at whiskey, one three left approach. Right. 4,000. Okay. Now we might turn right direct destination. We turn direct destination, I'm looking at. Still at 4,000, we're pretty high, or, or can we get lower? So 4,000, maintain 3,000. 
Seven eight three thousand. Seven four four. Why not go back to Jelly to maintain two thousand? Three thousand. Okay. He's really slam dunking us. Ray Fox Red Hotel, flying a one one zero. Maintain four thousand. Southside three fifteen. Real approach back to the ILS on two left. All right, expect it. Okay. Uh, 3315 is going to maintain 5,000. 500 to go. Okay. I believe the plate up now. I need to reference that. Thank you, Charlie. Can I get there? 12610. Good morning. Nine seven four four flooding at two seven zero. Two seven zero seven four four. Southwest thirty three fifteen. Center main ten four thousand. Six nine seven four four is five miles. Final approach fix. Flooding at two one zero. Maintain three till established. Clear to ILS one eight approach. Okay, two one zero three thousand. Clear for the ILS one eight seven four four. That's twenty three twenty five. Center maintain five thousand. 5,000, South plus 2395. Altitude capture. Uh, put on my speed brakes, which are the landing lights. Seventeen inches. Manifold pressure that gives us about blue line plus Number 69744, Connect McKinney Tower 118.82, good morning. Tower 1882, 744, good day. McKinney Tower, hello, Twin Cessna 69 or 744, ILS 18. Stand by for gear and flaps. Cessna 69744, McKinney Tower, runway 18, cleared to land. Clear land 18744. Just about glide slope intercept. Gear down, flap 15. Cessna 744, request a bases report on final, please. 744, we'll go. Okay, gears down and locked. Gas, undercarriage, mixture, props. Go around, boost, flaps to go. Okay, we'll set this approach altitude, uh, 2,400 feet. Light slope captured. And I can see the ground, but it's kind of ragged. Once that's a sub four four, there's an overcast layer at uh, the base is at uh, 2,000 MSL, and then there's a broken layer that's uh, about 1,700 feet MSL. Thank you. Runways in sight, landing. Gears down and lock, gas undercarriage, mixture prop, boost, flaps, landing check complete. Gears still down, three green.
Cessna 744, are you coming into the air center? 744, that's affirmative. Cessna 744, turn right, Bravo 3, and straight into the ramp. Bravo 3, straight into the ramp, 744, thank you. Right, after landing flow, strobe lights off, pitot heat off, landing lights are tracked, taxi light on, fuel pumps off, primary set for takeoff, laps up, mixture ground lean. To 